What is up YouTube? Welcome to my October recap. I honestly did not think I would be filming this video just because the month of October was so hectic, but here we are. The month started out really slow for us. Um, it was just me sorting through things, selling our furniture and stuff while Ty was still in season. We really got rid of so much stuff. Like when I look at what we were able to bring, we really did bring everything we need. And I honestly feel like I could purge some of the things that we brought. I did quit my job. Um, I did not inquire that if I could bring it with me to Utah, but I purely quit just because I wanted to pursue social media full time and hopefully everything works out. We were able to hang out with our friends and spend time with them. Corn Bellies is sort of like a pumpkin patch with rides and all of those things and food in Utah so we were able to enjoy some quality time with them. Surely our last pumpkin patch event in Utah. Um, so I'm just including a lot of different pictures that we took that night just kind of filling up the space of the bullet journal because that week a whole bunch of packing and not really anything exciting. Our friends purchased our dining table and chairs so we were able to take it to them and hang out with them one last time before um, the week just went hectic. Elena truly misses them and we miss them so much. Here she is just saying their names as I'm bullet journaling. Anna e. Who's that? Boo Boo? Who's that? Antina. Good job. We did take a trip to Yellowstone this past month and it was definitely needed for us mentally. Everything was pretty hectic and stressful, but just to be able to be out in nature and kind of disconnect from the world, it was everything I ever want <laughs> and need. Uh, we were able to take my nephew with us, which was really nice because we wanted him to have memories with Elena or Elena to have memories with her cousin, especially because we were moving away from him 
and his family, my sister. So um, it was really special to us to be able to have taken him and just have photos and videos, which by the way, I do have to edit the video videos from our trip which hopefully will go up next week i don't know we'll see but <laughs> i'm just filling up the week with these photos <laughs> I did cut my daughter's hair before we moved. Um, I wanted her hair to grow in thicker, and yes, it was her second haircut. I did get piercings on my ears. I got my tragus pierced and my upper right ear pierced, and I want more, <laughs> basically. This was like a hodgepodge week. We ate at Bucket of Crawfish, one of my favorite restaurants out in Utah, um, and it was my last time. I'm definitely gonna miss it. So I have to shout out my cousin who makes these bomb cookies. If you are in the Southern California area, you need to check her out. Her name is listed on the screen. It's at Doe's Cookies on Instagram. Oh my gosh, these cookies hit the freaking spot. <laughs> We are home and we are so happy. This month was a whirlwind for sure. It definitely flew by in the blink of an eye, but man, it was a good month, I would say. Um, currently, we are just unpacking, settling in, and for me, I'm trying to take advantage of the time and film and create these 2021 bullet journals that hopefully I will have available at the end of this month. So I hope you guys are excited for that and looking forward to it. I do plan to offer a few styles as well as a customized option. Thank you so much for tuning into this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I look forward to what the rest of the year has in store as well as 2021 and I hope you guys are too. If you haven't already, please subscribe because that would mean so much to me. If you do want to keep up with me elsewhere, I am on Instagram and TikTok at Modern Twines. Thank you so much for tuning in and I will see you in my next one.